T A B C D E F G. I have to put lotion on a cloth. How the heck am I supposed to put moisturizer over a full face? It's like, excuse me? Let's shower with our makeup on. Hey you guys, it's Julia here. In this video, we're gonna be doing my morning routine, but there's a twist. It's in alphabetical order. What's up, bitches? Ah! I saw that this was like a trend with makeup, like about two months ago or something like that. And then I saw Sophie Louise did living her entire day for 24 hours in alphabetical order. And I was like, let's do a combination of the two and just do my morning routine in alphabetical order. Let me know if you wanna see any other alphabetical order videos in the comments down below. And make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Also, I mentioned this not in my previous video, but the video beforehand that I'm actually holding a giveaway and it's gonna be extended for another month because I was lame and I couldn't get enough videos up this month and I just wanted to give you guys a fair shot to enter. So I'm gonna be giving away two prizes. The first prize is AirPods and all you gotta do to enter this is subscribe to this channel and my second channel, Julia Gilman. It's linked in the description box below and make sure you turn on the bell notification for both channels. And then just comment rainbow emojis on this video so I know who's entering. The next prize is a Polaroid camera and all you gotta do to enter for this one is subscribe to this channel, hit the bell notification button, and then follow my Instagram at Julia Gilman and hit the post notification button there. And then just comment a bunch of rainbow emojis on my recent photos so I know that you entered. And that's basically all you gotta do. Just stay active on all my accounts and I will pick a winner on this date a month from today. And then I'll just announce the winner on Instagram. But without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into the video. Good morning world! Welcome to my alphabetical morning routine. I'm actually at my parents' house right now. If you're an OG here, you might recognize this bed and the Tiffany blueness of this room. I'm visiting for a little bit. But anyway, I'm very, very hungry. Whenever I wake up, the first thing that I do is get myself some breakfast. And luckily the first thing in this alphabetical order is to get some breakfast. Let's get up. Let's get this date going. I should probably add cleaning my room to this list. Good morning. Good morning, mom. <gasps> What's for breakfast? She's so nice. She makes my breakfast when I'm here. Yeah, only when you're here. And B is our first letter in my getting ready, so. Bananas. We have bananas. Yes. We have no bananas. We lost our bananas last night after going to Target. I went bananas. <laughs> Oh my god. My jokes, my puns. What is in your kitchen today, Chef Mom? Bagels. Bagels. They start with a B. Bagels start with a B. Although my food doesn't have to start with like, you know, a B. Okay, but we're gonna do bagels. Are you a little bagel? Are you a bagel cat? A bagel cat. I'm out. Oh. 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 You're so cute. Okay, you guys, so we got our first. B in this alphabetical morning routine. We got an everything bagel and we have a orange juice. Thank you, mom. Okay, I'm just gonna eat this and probably watch like a YouTube video while I eat. Next we have on our list is to brush my teeth. Um, I am obsessed with this toothpaste. It's the Hello Activated Charcoal Plus Natural Dragon Fruit Toothpaste. It stings in the perfect best way possible. My toothbrush and my toothpaste are both black. I like to match. I'm just gonna brush my teeth. All right, folks, the next letter we have on the list is C. Clean my room. <laughs> Fun, yeah. Here's a little overview of what we gotta do. We gotta put the bed away. We gotta put this stuff away. I gotta organize, itemize my sh And I'm gonna find some copyright music to listen to while you guys listen to some non-copyright music during this cleaning montage. Feels so nice in here, so nice and clean. So crisp and so clean. Oh, yeah. What? It's line. Okay. So now that we've finished cleaning, we have another C word coming up. Clothes. I really don't feel like getting dressed right now though because I haven't showered. Um, I have to take a poop and I like to poop 
shower, then put on fresh clothes because <laughs> Ooh, um, not that I don't like clean my butt, but like this is low-key kind of triggering for me because I used to have really really bad OCD and like some of these things just kind of like hit that OCD trigger on me. I feel like it never really goes away and things will still trigger you when you have OCD. So let's just do it. Welcome to my closet. This door won't open all the way because my brother put all of his college books right behind it. So <laughs> this is about all we can get into. From my closet, I pulled these jean shorts that I got from Urban Outfitters. Then I found this shirt that I've never actually worn. It has a tag on it from Topshop. And I feel like this could be kind of cute with the shorts, maybe. And then I found this shirt, which also could be cute with the short. Don't know if it's gonna fit. Here's the outfit. It's tragically basic, but I don't want to wear a bra and this shirt works without a bra. It's a little see-through. This looks so weird together. Um, I think we're just gonna do the basic black and jean shorts. Ta-da! I'll find a cardigan to kind of like balance it out or a flannel so it's not so freaking basic. C-A-B-C-D-E-F-G equals A-B-C-D. What's next? H hair. Normally after I put my clothes on, we would do my... I really still have a house phone? Who still has a house phone? So, I'm not gonna do anything too crazy to my hair. It's already... Typically I would shower then do my hair and put these products in, but since I couldn't shower first, we're just gonna have to put the products in without the shower, so my hair is already decently okay naturally. We have a curl cream. I really don't like to use this unless my hair is wet, so we're just gonna use a very small amount. I am so thirsty. Oh my god, my I feel parched. Wow, I need water. Everyone in Philadelphia says water. Um, by the way, my hometown, which we're at right now, is Philadelphia. I think I've always said water, but it's so weird because I really hear it every time I go to the go to a restaurant. They're like, "Would you like some water?" I'm like, what? "Okay." So now we're gonna take this is like a finishing spray for curls. So put it in my curly waves. We have a little bit left. Cool. Okay, does anybody remember Coach? Well, I found this in my closet. It's like a vintage coach headband. If anybody is like a designer fan, you might know the vintage Takashi Louis Vuitton bags. This is like a coach copy, but I actually think it's kind of cute. Definitely jazzes up the outfit a bit. Oh my god, I gotta wear it like this. Okay, so next on our list is J for jewelry or Julia. Let's put on some jewelry, guys. I basically keep all of my jewelry in this jewelry holder slash mirror thingy, but it is taped closed because for whatever reason my mom's like paranoid and thinks somebody's gonna come and steal things. But the funny thing is I don't keep my, well one, I don't really have too crazy expensive jewelry. The other thing is I keep all my expensive jewelry with me. This is all like cheap costume jewelry. We're gonna put on these gold earrings. So they weren't cheap, but I love them and they were worth it. From Sex with Avenue's outlet. I'm loving this video. This video kind of reminds me of like old school beauty guru days Maybe because I'm filming in my old school beauty guru room. Now we're gonna put on this bracelet. This is my favorite bracelet I wear every day. And this is from Tiffany's. I got it when I was 12. Whoa, this is twisted as fuck. This is actually really good quality, but it was like only $50 from Macy's and I love it. And I got it four years ago. And uh, I hate cheap jewelry because it turns colors. And this has not, and this was like pretty affordable in my opinion. <sighs> I got it. Thank you. Next, I have this cute little David Yurman bracelet that I got. Oh no, I think I got this when I was 10. I got this one when I was 12. I don't know. They still fit. They're like baby bracelets. And then my most expensive piece of jewelry is this ring that I got to celebrate like, I think a million subscribers. That is all the jewelry that we're gonna wear. So I like to keep it simple. <laughs> We're back in my bathroom because guess what we have to do now? Lotion. I always do my lotion after I shower and I always do it naked. I have to put lotion on all clothed, but luckily I'm wearing shorts and short sleeves. Since this is a clothed lotion sesh, y'all get to watch. Guys, keep your skin hydrated because when you get old, if you don't lotion your skin, you're way more inclined to get wrinklies. Keep your skin hydrated, keep it lotioned, Keep that SPF on, you don't want to get skin cancer. You don't want no cancer. So 
we made it to the letter M, which is makeup. So basically that means it's time to do my makeup in full alphabetical order because we're going all in on this. First things first, we're gonna do my blush because everybody starts with their blush first. Said nobody ever. Got my makeup all in here. We have our strawberry blush, yay. Get my chocolate Soleil bronzer here. Smells like chocolate. Tastes like chocolate. It's chocolate. Got some brows, bitches. <laughs> Concealer time. I like to cover up my mustache when it's not waxed. A bitch needs to get her mustache waxed. Contour time. A, B, C, D, E. It's about eye cream. Oh my god, I'm almost out. Wow. Eyeliner time. Oh shit, this eyeliner's dried up. Much better. Steal on my favorite. Bitch, it's shadow time. I always love doing a pink eyeshadow. I'm gonna take cobbler. Some turkey cobbler. Is that? No, I don't know what a cobbler is. But I'm gonna take some cobbler and put that in the crease. Next, we're gonna highlight. Honey, we are officially done with the eyeshadow. It's time to some ASMR. It's time for foundation. And this foundation I love, but I brought her with me thinking I was gonna go get a tan last weekend, but it rained, so I didn't. And I'm still my pale self, so this is not gonna match my face. It's just gonna be the way. <sighs> That's just the way it is. Things will never be the same. That's just the way it is. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna put it on my hand. I just have to do the do. <laughs> All right, highlight time. Now we're on to L for lips. This is from Kiehl's. And then this lip oil gloss from Tarte. Mascara time. Fun fact about me is I didn't learn my ABCs till I was like five turning six. Also didn't learn to read like actual books till I was seven. No, no, I got mascara on my nose. Unfortunately, the next thing we have is our moisturizer. How the heck am I supposed to put moisturizer over a full face? It's like, excuse me, we're doing it. I'm ready for the beach. Now we have our primer. Smash the box primer. Now it's time to put on setting powder. There, all set. Last but certainly not least, we're gonna use a setting spray to set everything in. I always love this part. Here's the finished makeup. It's definitely not the best. Okay, so I'm on the toilet. I'm gonna do the poop thing and I'll get back to you after because you don't need to watch me poop. That's like, so. We made it to S, which is shower, obviously. Let's shower with our makeup on. to the W's, which is to wash my face. And then we have W-O, which is workout. So I got the workout clothes on. <laughs> I've never had a more ass backwards morning routine and I've been making YouTube videos for a while and I've definitely done some pretty ass backwards morning routines, but this is the most. We're gonna take the Bliss Rose Gold Residue Gentle Foaming Cleanser for sensitive skin because I'm a highly sensitive skinned person and a highly sensitive person in general. If any of you guys are wondering why I didn't wash my hair, it's because I like to wash my hair like once a week. Skin is done. Now for our last W and final activity of this ABC morning routine, work out!
We're about to go to the gym for... Well, one of us is about to go to the gym. One of us is taking the other one to the gym. For a, a little workout, like a, like a baby workout, like barely a workout. We're here at LA Fitness. I'm gonna do some stairs. Oh, Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell notification button, and give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below any other videos you want to see from me, and I will either see you in my next video or my previous video, which you can click at the end. Love you. Bye.